So if, uh, if this was your job in an enterprise to like, you know, look at this table of things or, or do some, something related to this, uh, and there was many of you all doing, uh, all needing that, that unit of functionality, which is to get that, given some input data, to get that output table of things that have been grouped by and sorted and, and summed and that kind of stuff. Uh, you could either have a Jupyter Notebook with that snippet of code where someone sends it to you and then you can copy and paste it into your own Jupyter Notebook and then with some comments that helpfully say, create a variable called you know, df above with these columns. Uh, or they give you a Python package which, which includes a function which says, generate table x. You know, having a Python package with that function that says generate table x is arguably a better way to distribute that unit functionality than just a, a snippet which has assumptions about what uh, what's above and below it and all that kind of stuff. It's simpler to understand, true. simpler to use. There's less possibility of user error. You're not going to go in and mess up the code. But then the downside is that you can't modify it unless you yep. descend to that lower level. So that's 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 the downside, and also in some cases the advantage, because the advantage oh, of not being able yes. to modify it is that then you're consistent with everyone else in the firm that's mm -hmm. doing the same thing. Hmm. 